Hey, Arlie, brothers and sisters, just wanted to be uh, one of the first ones to throw out uh, a review and uh, kind of a once over on the new 2023 Harley Davidson Road Glide 3. This is uh, just introduced to us this year. Absolutely love this thing. I picked it up on Tuesday. Um, this is actually my very first three wheeler. I've never had one before. I've been uh, riding Harleys since the late 80s, um, full dressers night train, dinas, all kinds of good stuff. Um, but uh, due to multiple knee surgeries, I uh, went ahead and, and took the bullet. I like the tri-glides, um, but I wasn't ready for, uh, for that long haul trucker, so to speak. And I really didn't like the freewheeler. Um, really was never a fan of the Road King either. So um, this one came out and uh, probably just like y'all was like, holy crap. So first things first, um, it is a freewheeler body with the shark nose fairing on it. So you road glide uh, lovers, I know exactly what you're feeling. Again, I came off of a 2020 road glide special. I had a 131 kit in it. I had a chopped tour pack. I put lowers on it. I had a kick-ass stereo system, 14-inch bars. Um, I pretty much uh, uh, had it uh, drawed up to the hilt, had tab, tab uh, 4.5. Uh, bam sticks with zombie baffles in it. Uh, it was a screamer, total screamer. So it was a big jump uh, coming down into this trike. Um, but actually over the last two days, I've put a little over 200 miles on it and I actually like it. I like the way it rides. Um, down here in Florida, there's uh, a lot of stop and go traffic, a lot of people. And this has actually been pretty comfortable, not having to balance, not having to keep my feet down not burning my calf um, on that hot ass 131 engine um, but again I'm pleasantly surprised so far what I've done is I've done a nine inch sport clockworks uh, smoke windshield absolutely awesome um, I've put the zero 3d phone mount and cup bound on there I put the uh, Harley Davidson um, tank bra, I guess that's what you call it. Um, also took my uh, Harley Davidson tall seat and put it on here, uh, works comfortably. Put the backrest on there for mama, went ahead and put on the luggage rack. And um, <laughs> I got a clearance on the Kiriakin Crusher exhaust on it. So the stock exhaust, yeah, after 30 miles an hour, you can't even hear it. So you're having to look at the tack all the time. Went ahead and upgraded to these crushers. They sound pretty good. I can hear them um, all right, but I will be putting some uh, Tab Performance BAM sticks on this sucker when I get to that point. Um, looking to do a Stage 2 kit on it, um, replacing the air intake and the cam, and uh, again, getting those uh, Tab BAM sticks put on it with the zombie baffles. Going to be looking into getting uh, a new wheel set, I'd like to get an engine guard uh, with some lower fairings so I can put some speakers in there. Um, thought about trying to, I don't know, fit some speakers down in this area. I don't know. Maybe somebody's got an idea of what to do. But other than that, uh, it rides actually really well. Um, to me, uh, being my first trike, it's like riding a four-wheeler um, off-road, kind of having to lean to do your steer you're leaning into the turn kind of like you are with the bike but if you're sitting straight up and you try to turn this thing it wants to throw you the opposite way but anyway i just wanted to uh get this out there for everybody um not really sure where i'm going to take it but i'm sure i'm going to take it somewhere and i'm going to enjoy the ride all right you guys take care